Good morning, Sandy. What's that? You're thirsty? Well, what do you want to have to drink? Coffee? You can't drink coffee. Coffee's not for puppy dogs. Coffee's for big people. You want to watch me make a cup of coffee? Okay. Okay, puppy dog. Here we go. So we're going to make some coffee. And the first thing you need is some really good coffee beans. And my favorite are these right here. They're Sumatra beans from Trader Joe's and I've tried a lot of different coffee beans and these are my favorite. So I'm going to make coffee today just like I make it every day with the exception that today I'm going to be making the coffee with one hand. So what I do is I pour the coffee beans into the grinder so it just about covers the blade. You're supposed to put in a tablespoon for every four ounces of coffee. So that would be about two tablespoons. But I put it in until the beans just about cover the blade. There. Oh, I can still see it a little bit. There. And now the blade's covered, so we've got enough coffee beans and put the top on the grinder and I usually grind the coffee for about maybe 10 or 12 seconds. So here goes, it's gonna get, gonna get noisy so you wanna cover your ears. and that should be fine. So the next thing we need is to put the coffee in the coffee press. There's a little bit more, there we go. And there's the coffee. What do you think? <gasps> do you hear that? That's the water. The water's boiling just in time. Okay. Let's get the water off the stove. There it is. Okay, now we're going to pour the water in and maybe I think we'll fill it about halfway full, okay? Here goes. There we go, just right. And then we take the top for the coffee press and you can see there's a little gate there that's grated. So we don't want that facing towards the spout because the coffee needs to brew in there. So we just put it so the closed part is near the mouth of the coffee press and put it like that. And now we wait. Takes about mm, four minutes or so and then the coffee will be ready to press and to pour into the cup. Okay, well I think the coffee is about done steeping there. So why don't we uh, go ahead Sandy and pour it into the cup, okay? First thing we got to do though is turn the top so that the grate that lets the coffee out, there it is, is facing the spout. And then you just take the plunger and you kind of gently push it down all the way till the little strainer part gets to the bottom of the pot. There it is. And then you pour the coffee into the cup. Now this is a really big coffee mug. So you know, 
it's not all the way to the top, but that's still a pretty big cup of coffee. And so now we're gonna put something sweet. We've got some sugar. And a little bit of half and half. I kind of do a visual. When it starts to lighten up, I'm like, okay, that's enough. Ooh, pretty. And now the coffee's all ready to drink. Mmm. Well, there you go, Sandy.